Big Brother, this is Echo Romeo Alpha. Target is secure. RTB. <laughs> This is Inspector Harley at beginning session five of the investigation for incident 096-1-Alpha. I am here with Dr. Daniels. Hello, doctor. Have you caught it yet? Yes. You'll be pleased to hear containment has been attained. Oh, thank God. We do have some questions, obviously. It's been very difficult to get a clear picture of the case. We hope you can help us. Yes. Yes, of course. Good. Now, Doctor, for the record, where were you when containment was broken? I was on an excavation in the mountains, comparing lab samples with local geology. And in your absence, who was in charge of the lab? Dr. Oleksii. And how was 096 being held? As per protocol. 096 is being kept in a Class 13 containment cube. No windows, no cameras, no one that is possible to see its face. Any instrumentation or life support system is in strict compliance. Thank you. When exactly was containment broken? I haven't been informed of the exact time yet. Yes, of course. Apologies, Doctor. We're a bit disorganized ourselves. Doctor? Are they watching us? You must be more specific, Doctor. The O5, are they watching us? Yes. Well, maybe now they'll listen to me when I say we need to kill it. This could have been a catastrophe. Unfortunately, it's a bit too late for could have been, Doctor. What do you mean? Let's start from the beginning, shall we? Relax, Doctor. All protocols have been followed. All personnel inside Stage 2 containment saw its face. Unfortunately, that was just the start. Recording. Okay, uh, this is researcher Michael Allen. And researcher Daryl Landry. Reporting an event with 096. At approximately 1557, Audio blips were picked up by sensors Alpha-1 and Alpha-2. There it is again. The readings are showing 096 on the north wall, stationary. You should uh, get Alexi down here. It should hold, right? Just get a hold of Alexi! 
It rapidly became clear that 096's target, which we've labeled 096-1, was nowhere close by. Wait, wait, wait. In the event of a stage one breach, the automated protocols ensure that a sleeping agent- The automated is... protocols fail to start. In the event of an automation failure, it would be up to the operations chief, in this case, Dr. Alexi. Well, where the hell was he? He was found hiding in a janitorial closet. In Division Three. Dead. Dead? Indeed. Lexi, you idiot. I'm sorry for your loss, Doctor, but we do have a lot more to cover. After breaching the base, 096 moved in a straight vector towards the mountains. <laughs> This is Hog-1 approaching estimated target location, over. Copy Hog-1, maintain vector. I think I've got something. Target visual. Clear for strafing round, over. You're clear. satellite thermal imaging, oftentimes, we were only able to track it by the path of destruction it left. About two hours into pursuit, it crossed a state highway. We were lucky it was slightly traveled at the time, but 12 people still saw its face. We needed more preparation for when, not if, but when there was a breach. You did have a considerable budget, Doctor, but it, it seems that most of your focus was on the scramble goggles. Yes. I've said time and again that the Scramble program was the only achievable technology to give us a fighting chance. Especially when you assholes wouldn't let me do proper research. As I said, it has always been a win. Doctor, please, we have a lot more to cover. Finally, 096 reached victim 096-1, a young man who lived on a small farm at the foot of the mountain. his wife and newborn child. Ian? Ian? by something, Dr. Daniels. Why didn't you let me kill it? For the record, Doctor, you don't know how to kill it. Much of the research you've requested equates to torturing 096, which is inhumane. Inhumane? Inhumane? There's nothing human about that thing! This is insane. People have died. Yes, Doctor, people have died. Isn't that a tragedy? You people are a bunch of goddamn psychopaths. Our only concern is to secure, contain, and protect. Which brings us to our next point. 
your scramble goggles. Tell me, how do they work? Just for the record, Doctor. They're mixed reality goggles. Each eye is fed a video feed, and an AI detects and scrubs out 096's face from the image. Brilliant solution to a very complicated problem. Expensive, too. It's a shame they didn't work. What? Let's continue. Tell one, be advised. You're approaching the compound. One Bravo, clearing structure line. mobile task force we have. They should have worked. All my tests, they were supposed to work. All of this brings us to the source of this tragedy. I believe the important part is still in the envelope, Doctor. Is this? Yes. What was an original photograph of 096 in the wild. Someone photographed it? We dated the photograph to the 1980s. It seems the original photographer and all of its subsequent viewers were completely unaware of 096's presence. Until a young man at the farmhouse, that is. This has been scratched out by hand. By who? How? Your scramble goggles proved to be somewhat useful, after all. Thank <laughs> you. 
Big Brother. Target is triggered. Six's face was so small in the image it took up less than four pixels. Four pixels caused all of this. Four fucking pixels. I'm sorry. What are you sorry for, Doctor? Everything. They were supposed to work on my plans. The goggles. They were supposed to save lives. What was the final casualty count? 15 civilians, 48 Foundation members, 63 deaths in total. So, that's what all this is about. So much death. And you want someone to pin it on, eh? Someone to punish. Doctor, in here, you will find the clearances necessary to begin termination trials on SCP-096. The O5 Council has come to your side. Do you mean I'm allowed to kill it? You're allowed to try. All we ask is that in your termination attempts, you solidify the research and create a more effective solution to our containment needs. Dr. Daniels, is there anything else you'd like to say on record? No. No, I think that's everything. Very well then. This concludes session five of the SCP-096-1 Alpha investigation. Doctor, again, my condolences to you for the loss of your colleagues. smart. I'll give him that. Yeah. Are the O5 still in line? We're still here. And Inspector Everett is right. Well done, Arlia. Thank you, madam. It was short of a confession, but I believe we have enough. It's a shame. Daniels really is brilliant. If he were more motivated, perhaps he could have unlocked the secrets to 096's uncanny sensory abilities. Easy to. He's proven his point. The only thing he's proven is that he's as much of a monster as he considers us. That's enough. Inspector Arlia, after everything you just saw, has your hunch been confirmed? I believe so. The way he handled the photograph, he's definitely familiar with it. I suspect he's been holding on to it for a stunt like this. But still, how could he have warned Alexei? His absence in the control room was our first lead. Outside help? Has Alexei given us anything new? No. He's staying loyal. Although his initial discrepancies are damning enough. Get what we can out of him. Then he's to be terminated. Quickly and quietly. Remember, he's officially already dead. Yes, madam. When do we inform Daniels that we know he orchestrated the breach? Only after he kills it. 